Good afternoon from the desk of Brock. We have a couple public service announcements today that could help you out in your academic endeavors. First of all, juniors and seniors who have first period option, remember that is not the flame at the JFK Memorial. They are not perpetual option period. That may change at the end of the 18 weeks. If you have more than 10 tardies to school, if you have more than 10 absences, you will be put out of options into a first period class. And I know what you're thinking. I don't need any classes. I don't need any more classes. I don't need those to graduate. Too bad. If you have too many tardies or too many absences, you're going to be put in the class. Option period will go like the bird. Bye bye. Okay, now for the good news. We now have vouchers for semester classes. Vouchers for semester classes. It is based on tardies, not on attendance. End of year vouchers will still be based on attendance. Semester vouchers will be based on tardies to school. The good news is this. If you have an A in the class, an A in the class, semester or year end, you do not have to take the final. Repeat, if you have an A in the class, you do not have to take the final. Vouchers work semester-wise just like year-end vouchers do for attendance. Zero to two, you get four vouchers. Three to four, you get less. Five to six, you get less. Seven to, seven to eight, you get one. That's the way it works. I will post this across from the office. If you want to take a look, great. Don't wait, though. What the smart people do about prom, vouchers, and the rest of that stuff, they check with me throughout the school year, and then they're not surprised, and then they don't cry. Oh, he's a horrible person. He's killing us. I can't believe he would do this to us. It's not me. It's you. Goodbye from the desk of Brock. Have a good day. Welcome back to Studio 203. I'm Layla. And I'm Bailey. And here are your announcements for Friday, September 14th. Seniors, the following scholarships are now available in the guidance office. The Elk's Most Valuable Student Scholarship and the National Co-op Scholarship. If interested, stop in for a copy. Any junior or senior interested in meeting with visiting college representatives can stop in the guidance office to sign up. The schedule is as follows. Slippery Rock University will be visiting on Tuesday, September 18th at 11 a.m. Westminster College of Miss Westminster College on Wednesday, September 26th, and University of Akron on Monday, October 1st. Juniors and seniors, the college and career fair permission forms and money are due today. Class of 2021 fundraiser, show off your Quaker pride and get the Salem cube painted in your driveway. Flyers available in the high school office or see a member of the sophomore student council taking orders now and painting next week. There are some extra yearbooks for sale. Bring cash or write a check to Salem High School Yearbook for $80 and see Mrs. Parks for a copy. Get one while they last. Junior high students, collect box tops and turn them into your first period teacher. The class that collects the most box tops will receive a breakfast bash. Mrs. Jesco's class is in the lead. A weekly quote from your hero club. Spread kindness wherever you go. Let no one ever come to you without leaving happier. Attention 7th and 8th graders. If you are interested in running for student council, this announcement is for you. The forms for 7th grade, 8th grade student council are available in the main office outside of room 205. If you are interested in joining, please stop to pick up a form and complete and return today to the main office or Mr. Colbert's room 205. The High School Academic Challenge team will hold an organizational meeting on Tuesday, September 18th in Mr. Stratton's room 162 right after dismissal. Any high school student is welcome to join the team. Our practice will be over at 4 p.m. Please stop by and get an informational sheet and sign in even if you are playing a fall sport and plan to join us later in the season. Reminder to all seniors, senior personality papers are due to Mrs. Parks today. The varsity football team will host the Carrollton Warriors at Riley Stadium tonight. Tickets are now available in the athletic department for $7 for adults and $4 for students. All tickets at the gate will be $7. Put, put your camera on and root for your Quakers. Attention all ladies that are interested in softball in grades 7 through 12. If you are interested in the game and want to learn and enhance your skills, 
There will be training sessions beginning soon. Please stop in the athletic department today. Sign up. Junior high school pictures will be September 20th next Thursday and high school pictures will be September 21st next Friday. All students must have their picture taken to be in the yearbook. The Office of Financial Aid and Scholarships at YSU is hosting a financial night on Tuesday, October 23rd at 6.30 p.m. for high school students and parents. Online registration is at ysu.edu. Um, contact the office at 330-941-3505. For Studio 2 and 3, I'm Layla. <laughs> and I'm Bailey. Have a great day, Quigs. <laughs>